Help me understand magazines that date back eight years. Alex has the Museum of Mommy, all her thousands of CDs, memorabilia. She wants to show Luca when he's old enough to appreciate them who she is, who she was. She's a little scared to let go of her past. I've never kept a diary, and I always felt like the magazines were kind of like what I've done in my life. Like the, the current of events that I've been to or bands that I've been to see and something that reflects that time in my life. Alex seems to hold on to things because they're associated with some memory that she cherishes. This is what I call memory clutter. I can tell you right now, you are going to have to let go of close to 60% of the things that are in this room. Let go as in get rid of? Yes. What is it that Luca needs? Health yeah. and safety. Yeah. I want to show you this. Kneel down for a sec. I want to show you something. This is where Luca is. It was overwhelming to see my bedroom from Luca's perspective. It felt like everything was coming in on you because there was so much stuff. And look at eye level at the dresser. Very... I see push pins. I always felt like Luca was too young to be affected by my clutter, but I had my eyes opened a little there. What I would like to do right now is to go back into the living room. Alex's stuff is holding her back from seeing what matters most, and I need to reinforce with her what's really important here. I want you really quickly now to go anywhere in the house you want and get the three things that have the most significance for you that you would want to pass on to Luca. You have less than a minute. Go, right now. Are you serious? Right now, the three most important things. Five seconds. 50, I, I 49, <laughs> 48, 47, 46, 45, <laughs> 44, 40, 39, 38, 37, <laughs> 36, 35. I'm done. That's it. Yeah. So wait. Of all these things, when I put the pressure on you, you run and grab one item. Well, I guess my family is really important to me, and it's a picture of my grandmother, and she's no longer alive. She taught me a lot. What did she teach you? Well, she taught me kindness and compassion and empathy and... Mm -hmm. How to knit. Not one of those things is an item. See that? You're clinging to all of this, and the thing, the thing that most resonates with your heart are all those things about your grandmother that aren't on the table or in the magazine boxes or in the CD cases, but sit right here. You're a mother, the space is not working, you are clinging to so much from the past. Luca has only today, and this stuff is getting in the way. <laughs>